Okay, so I'm just going to blast through some of these, and I'm going to build up each one of my different labels to show you how fast we can actually get through this. So let's just see how long it takes to actually get through all of this. Let's start our timer here, and let's go. So we're going from 96 emails all the way down. Okay, so this one here, I don't need to do anything. Archive it, get it out of the way. If I want to find that one again, I just go type in Hootsuite, and boom, there it is right there. Now also, since I type that in, I notice here that none of these ones here, I do need to look at, but I can see that there's four in my inbox still. So to save me some time, I'm going to select all of these. I'm going to archive them all, get them all out of my inbox. Now I'm from 96 emails, or 97, down to 94 emails here. So let's just keep blasting through this. Okay, so this one here, let's see, I'm going to read this one later. Okay, archive, this one here, I'm going to deal with my manager, this one here, archive, this one here, it's going to take me a while to set up, so I'll action this one, this one here, I'll deal with later, so this one here, let's just say I want to deal with this when it's not pressing. So I will do this when I've got time. So my first option, my first action is to get out of the inbox, then go to my action folder, deal with all my actions, and then I'll go when I've got time to my later folder and deal with stuff there. So I've just labeled this as later. I'm going to archive this now. Okay. And we keep going. Now in this example here, I've got one that I, I've got an email I sent to myself um, that I want to label as ideas. Ideas is, is another uh, great place to store things. So if you've got ideas you want to review, this is a good context, uh, context label to use. So add ideas, perfect to use. Okay, so here we go. We're down to inbox zero. I have no new mail, and I'm in my inbox. How nice does that feel? It's fantastic. Okay, and the whole time that I took to do it was just about 11 minutes. So I went through a hundred and some emails there in about 11 minutes, and I was left with them nice and organized. So in 11 minutes, I now have my action folder for the day, so I'll spend some time on these specific emails here. I've got emails in my later folder that I'll go through, I've got emails I can deal with with my employees, with my managers, etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. So in only 11 minutes, I blasted through all of those emails. Imagine starting your day like that every day. It's a great habit to get into. What I have done is I have now put everything into my archive folder. So I've archived everything, and how I can get to that again is by going to More and then All Mail. And I'll see all the emails that I just archived, they're all inside here. You'll see some of these have different labels on them. The ones that were archived were just ones that I don't need to take any further action on. I can review them later if I want to, but they're just out of my inbox. That's the point. And here I've got this one is labeled as action, this one's labeled as waiting for, read. And of course I can see that uh, in the more convenient way of looking at the actual labels to the left here. So if I click read, these are the emails I've decided that I want to read later. And so when I've got time, I'm going to read these. I've got my employee. I've got one I want to review with my employee. I've got some emails I want to review with my manager. I've got uh, one for ideas, so ideas that I sent myself. These are emails I sent myself about you know things while I'm on the fly, if I'm walking around. I send myself an email if I have an idea. I go to my ideas inbox, and I can keep track of everything inside there. And my action uh, label here, I've got a whole bunch of different things here. Now these ones here are ones that are going to take me two minutes or longer to, to go through. So now that I've cleared up my inbox, my next step for efficiency is to go into my action folder and now go through these. Now I went from an email inbox of 101 down to 11. And if we consider this like a checklist, if you remember, this checklist now has 11 tasks. That's it. So what seemed overwhelming before with 101 now has 11. So this here is a fantastic, fantastic benefit of this. And as you'll see, it didn't cost me any money. There was no software required, nothing. This just allowed me to 
And as you see, this had no other software that I needed to use or anything, and it's super organized. So now what I'd do is I'd go through each one of these, and I'd spend the time. So let's say that this one here is going to take me some time to respond to. Now I'll take the time to respond to it, because I've only got 11 of those emails to actually go through. So hopefully that uh, made some sense. Let me know if you have any questions.